Hey, welcome to Beer Me. This is the Beer Show. Welcome Woo! to Beer Me. Tis the season. It's not quite there yet for that part, but it is the winter. That's why we got this treat. Fucker. Fucker. Treat. treat. Yeah, it's from a local brewery too. Stanley Park Brewing. That's, it's a brewery right in Stanley Park. The iconic Stanley Park, everybody. Uh, where's it from again? Stanley Park Brewing. Good stuff. Stanley, Stanley Park, Park Brewing, Brewing Cold, Cold Front Cold IPA. IPA. This is artwork. All right, we got four tall cans here. So you know what that means? A, half a can each. Honest to God, it was between this and two other beers, and we picked this because of the name. Yeah, uh, from Cold Front. It's November. Cold Front IPA, great fucking name. Also, it says here, sampling series, an ever-growing batch of fresh ideas. That's very clever, Martin. That's such a fucking good idea. Yeah. So sampling series means that, no. hey, we're trying it out, we're experimenting, you let us know. I have to say right now that whoever they hired for their marketing department is very professional. They're like top notch. Yeah, whoever you guys have designed the series, the labels, yeah. you make sure to give them a fucking raise or at least a Christmas bonus. Or they're already charging you through the fucking roof they by, should by how this looks. Look at that beautiful can. Look at pine needles. The color yeah. scheme is great, like the light blue and the oh, dark blue. Great. And all of those icons there, they pop. They pop like a hot cock. Oh, they pop. Oh. Do you want to tell them that your, uh, about your favorite part of this, Dave? What's that? The percentage. Six point four percent. It's a six point four percent beer. It's a ten out of ten. Not only do I want to give it a ten out of ten, I want to hire the marketing company just to make pointless shit for me. Yeah, I'm right there with you. Ten out of ten for me. Why are you wearing shoes? I don't know. I forgot to take them off the entire time. This is taste. <laughs> Looking at our immediate future, Dave, we're seeing a cold front washing in over our livers. Uh, time to taste what that's gonna feel like. More the better, right? Yeah, more the better. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Big Dick Jones here. Okay. Okay, it's very tree-y. I, I was gonna say, it tastes like a pine saw car or uh, uh, fresh yeah, air yeah. fresher. You guys know Frosty the Snowman, right? This tastes like wrapping your <laughs> lips around his bark-encrusted member. Oh, fuck, that's hot. I will say this. It does not taste like 6.4%. No, it does not. I'm gonna give it a 6 out of 10. I'm giving it a 7. This is smoothness. You wanna recap what smoothness is? I feel like some people don't really know. Smoothness is is what you get after you 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 swallow. <laughs> it's surprisingly smooth for an IPA. Yeah, it's supposed to be an amalgamation of lager and IPA. It, they nailed it. And you get a lot of the pine in your but mouth. But then it's gone. And then you get the uh, the lager. The hop is initial and then it and dissipates then real quick. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, they really do a good job with this fucking beer. I, I gotta admit, this is so smooth. I'm getting a crazy buzz too, which I love. I'm getting a huge buzz. It's worrisome, actually. It's a 10 out of 10 for smoothness. I'm giving it an 8 out of 10 for smoothness. This is Downability. Time to take this entire cold front into our mouths and see how it affects our bodies. Brrr. Whoa, is that? It's dead on. Dead oh, fucking on. Let's go. Cold front IPA, Stanley Park Brewing, dead on. Cold, cold front. front. This is where... This beer's really well done. The stars have aligned. Yeah, I feel great. I'm giving Downability a 9 out of 10. I'm right there with you. Hey, this is Reliability. Reliability! That means we fucking talk to you about uh, whether or not you could have a large quantity of this beer in a night. <laughs> I don't think you can. Uh, you couldn't, no. <laughs> if you're looking to get absolutely fucking pinned to the wall tonight, you're not going to be drinking tons of these. If I had to bring these to a house party, and I had to only drink this, I could make it work. But I wouldn't be enjoying myself as much the farther in I get. That's like fucking your neighbor's wife, huh? What if your neighbor is filming while you fucking neighbor's wife? Oh, he's a cuck. Oh, then all the more power. That's what I'm talking about. There's different strokes for different folks, and so long as I'm getting off, who cares? But I will go back to this and say that I am not a huge fan of this in terms of relying on it to get me through the night. So I, I completely disagree with everything you're saying. What about the 6.4%? This beer me? is fantastic. 6.4% is IPA. Do you, is this beer reliable for you? Uh, uh, 
No. Then what the fuck are we talking about? Yeah, okay, there it is. A five out of ten. Of course it's a five out of ten. Yeah. Five out of ten for me. This is final grade. Time to see how cold front did in school. Artwork, 110%. Whoever did this artwork is so... They, they got A's all in school. They got A's. They were the person that never went out, and then they started their own firm, and then they and then and then Stanley Park was lucky enough to hire these fucks. <laughs> Taste? It tastes like a handful of pine needles that I will continuously eat again and again. Smoothness? Whatever the fuck they tried to do, they did it, and it's smooth as a fucking oh silk panties. Ew. Down ability, it's really a perfect fucked up IPA to down. So, um, high praise all around. Reliability, you couldn't rely on it one bit, but it's so well made and so well advertised and so well everything, you have to admire it. I'm giving this a solid B. I'm giving it a B plus. Yeah. And you know what, Stanley Park Brewing? You're fucking welcome. There it is. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We love you. Please rate, review, subscribe, comment below. Let us know what beers you want us to try, and if we can find them, then chances are we're going to drink them. We're going to drink the shit out of them. Thanks for watching. We love you, and we'll see you next week. Yeah, fuck it.